I uh, learned about the Community Foundation from my friend Susan Freed of Freed Advisors. Shortly after I moved here from Connecticut, um, Susan introduced me and my daughter to the Community Foundation through a mother-daughter giving circle. What I tell my friends um, and my family about my experience with the Community Foundation is that it took some, it, it turned my husband and I from some well-intentioned check writing charitable givers um, to philanthropists with a strategic view on what's important to us and how we can make a difference in our community and, and around the world. The Community Foundation staff has really, they're willing to do just about anything that, that I can dream of from a philanthropic standpoint. I'll give you an example. Um, my children and I wanted to form a kid to kid giving circle where we could take kids who are comfortable with community service and really let them understand that philanthropy is a different piece of the important equation for nonprofits than community service. And I wanted to, we wanted to teach them how that piece of it works. And the Community Foundation staff made this dream possible. We've had four different funding cycles for our Kid to Kid Giving Circle, and the kids have collectively given away over $40,000 to local nonprofits that they've been able to visit, set up by the Community Foundation staff. They've been able to volunteer, and they really understand the value of their contributions and the impact that they're having on their own local community. Probably another reason is dealing with, you can be anonymous with a um, community foundation. Uh, since your private foundation, your 990PF is a public record, anybody can go out to guidestar.org and immediately pull up the private foundation for the organization. See if you, who your officers are, see who you've donated to in the past, and the community foundation will allow that to be anonymous rather than being out in the public domain. After I developed a relationship with the Community Foundation through this little giving circle, I really found that as a new person here in Montgomery County, it was really vital to me to, to learn who the players were in the, in the nonprofit space. Um, the Community Foundation had just a tremendous amount of resources to introduce me to those types of organizations that my family and, and I are most passionate about. Professional advisors, you do not have to actually lose control and investment of your assets for your client. The Community Foundation will work with you to set up a separately managed account for the assets that move over to the Community Foundation, and you will still have ability to manage those assets and receive a fee for managing those assets. You do not lose that when those assets go over to the Community Foundation. As professional advisors, you need to know the Community Foundation can accept a multitude of assets, not just stock, bonds, cash. They can accept real estate, closely held companies, so if you've got a client with um, a difficult asset to value or a difficult asset that is a transaction coming down the pike, they can work with you in terms of making a donation today and having the liquidity event later. They can also work with your clients in terms of helping build an endowment over time. So in essence, you know, having the money build rather than having everything go out the door at one, one specific point in time. Why you would really want to do a donor advised fund with the Community Foundation is higher AGI limits. In essence, you can give up to 30 or 50 percent of your adjusted gross income rather than 20 percent or 30 percent with a private foundation. For me, it gives me the simplicity of consolidated information. When I sit down at the end of the year to look at what I've given and what, what we've done with our funds, it's all in one place and I don't have to go back through check registers like I used to in the old days. After over 40 years of serving the National Capital Region community, nobody knows our community and its needs better than the Community Foundation.